Mastering conversations with prepositional verbs. Hello, English learners. Today we're diving into a fascinating aspect of the English language, namely prepositional verbs. We'll specifically focus on how to correctly use them in conversations to enhance your speaking skills and sound more like a native speaker. Firstly, let's understand what prepositional verbs are. A prepositional verb is a verb followed by a preposition. This combination creates a new meaning, different from the original verb. For instance, look at, or, wait for. Unlike phrasal verbs, the particle in a prepositional verb does not change the meaning of the verb drastically. Remember, you cannot separate the verb and the preposition in a prepositional verb. For example, it's incorrect to say, look it at. The correct form is, look at it. Let's now look at some commonly used prepositional verbs in English. 1. Depend on, to rely on someone or something. 2. Belong to, to be owned by someone. 3. Concentrate on, to focus on something. 4. Dream of, about, to imagine something in your sleep or when you're awake. 5. Listen to, to give your attention to a sound. We'll be using these examples in our upcoming sections to illustrate their use in conversation. Understanding prepositional verbs is one thing, but using them fluently in conversations is another. Let's illustrate this with examples. I depend on my alarm clock to wake up early every day. This book belongs to Mark. He left it here yesterday. It's important to concentrate on your tasks to be productive. I always dream of traveling to different countries. Always listen to your parents' advice. They want the best for you. Practicing these sentences will help you get comfortable with using prepositional verbs in your daily conversations. A common mistake learners make is separating the verb and the preposition in a prepositional verb. Remember, unlike phrasal verbs, we can't split prepositional verbs. So, it's incorrect to say, listen it to. The correct form is, listen to it. And there you have it, folks. You've just improved your English conversation skills by mastering the use of prepositional verbs. Keep practicing these tips, and soon you'll find yourself using prepositional verbs naturally and effectively. Until next time, happy learning!